the Triple Crown of Virginia in the books, it was time to finish up our southbound section. Going south was a very odd sensation. You would think it would feel the same as going north, because you're still hiking all day and camping and eating and sleeping outside, but every new person you saw or met, you were most likely not going to see again, which was kind of a bummer. Hot out, but there's a sign that says that there's hot dogs in four miles, so let's get it. It was also odd to be in a smaller group. We couldn't push giant miles because we were dependent on my mother picking us up and taking us up back north. There were great times and times where we felt down, but this meant we could laze around in areas for longer and make up tasks we wanted to do. A good example is Goatee trying to climb the Kiefer Oak tree for a more epic picture than everybody else's. Attempting would be the word to focus on here. What, what do you mean? Okay, but how are you getting down? Same way I got up. Okay, you're gonna trust that that board that's broken no. with duct tape? No, I'm not. Just, what? Just wait. It's broken! I'm not using it. <laughs> we got into the groove and embraced relaxing our last few days going south. With weather being very volatile, with rain or high humidity every single day, our gear was in a constant state of wet. Who are you talking to, ma'am? now. He's scared. He's not moving. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Luckily, we had trail angels come to our rescue a few times. Here we go. That's awesome, guys. My fave being this pumpers who loved playing fetch. Here's to the good days, here's to the sorrow. I have very fond memories about the conversations we had around this fire. It was nights like these that look insignificant from the outside. But in reality, they were where the bonds we started earlier on trail became unbreakable. We had finally made it to the last day going south. This had us descending into the town of Harrisburg once again. This is a song about the way it feels, the way you burn, the way you heal. Mama Friday picked us up and took us to Angel's Rest. To stir it up, stare in his ugly face, to reconcile with the angry beast in a crowded space. No, it's nothing draws a crowd. Right. Don't get big, like yeah, because they only once they start getting That's well, no, I... She also gifted Sherlock and I new poles. <laughs> Hers needing her place a little bit more than mine. They sat in the seat with me. <laughs> After a quick stop for town food, we were back to northbound hikers. leggings with the little uh velcro <laughs> oh my god when it came time to finally start heading north this had us hiking the shenandoahs or as hikers call them the shennies goat had decided it was time to push bigger miles and so he took advantage of the shenandoahs flatter terrain and hiked 33 miles the next day with him gone i had to make a choice of slowing down with my homies sherlock and aka or dedicate my hike to bigger miles. I decided to stay. 
I missed him, but hikers gotta hike. The Shenny's was a magical place where food carries became a thing of the past. Because every few miles you had things called waysides. These are my favorite chips. <laughs> I got three of them. These were hiker hubs where you would eat and drink and charge your electronics without having to really leave trail. And a milkshake. Because <laughs> I needed both. Red cheese. Ooh. Breakfast. Nice. Snack. Nice. Some more snacks. <laughs> Did you need any more snacks? <laughs> snacks. <laughs> there she goes. There she goes. I don't know if it was us as a trio or the feeling of meeting your friends, but we acted like the Shenny's was a vacation. Because the lady comes down, and I was like, Yeah, I'm missing track and poles. She's like, There's some sitting up on the rock up there, probably about a quarter mile. I was like, Can you watch my stuff for me? I'm gonna. And even though I loved the people I was meeting, I was really missing goat. I'm already three beers in, I'm good. Yo. I'd be down for some kids. <laughs> it sucked having to say goodbye to Sherlock and AKA, but it is part of the journey, and I have no regrets. I want to skip miles. <laughs> Everyone has to hike their own hike. And my point with that is, is there's no wrong way to do it. The only thing you really have to do is to respect everybody's choice. <laughs> Catching up to GOAT meant also reuniting with a few familiar faces. We were on our last stretch of Virginia. This meant we would be hitting West Virginia in the next few days, and the metaphorical halfway point of this journey. All right, now you can do it. Just drink some of this. Yeah, just drink it. Hydrate. How do you do that? Can't make that up right there. <laughs> <laughs> 